Let's Play Final Fantasy VI, and we're going to have us a nice rock and roll time today again, just like always. So, um, as long as Doomgaze doesn't attack us, we ought to be able to go back to Daryl's tomb, because I apparently missed something when I was over there. And I'm sure by the time I finally get this video posted, someone's going to point it out, but... <laughs> Uh, yeah, gee, I'm getting lost here. That place inside where you could carve numbers into the tomb, or you could carve something into the tomb. Oh, lordy. We are at missing sprint shoes. Oh my goodness, all I got is sets that are here? No, that's not gonna work. How did that happen, I wonder? How did that happen? Okay, that was a close one. Let me just get my party together, I'll be right back. Okay, now I guess we're ready to do this again. Let's see what we can do about picking up this missing piece here. I'm not even sure what you get for this, but... Hmm. It's not that hard to get. Okay. Blind car something? Yes. Nothing appropriate comes to mind. Oh, shoot. Maybe I have to read those other ones first. I'm assuming that's what I gotta do. Weren't they down here? I don't even really remember. Alright, Alka Seltzer gained a level there. Now, where the heck were those tombs, man? I ain't got all day to be looking around here. I was just trying to pick up a loose end here. Maybe they were on the other end. Okie dokie, let's just check over here then. I don't think they're up here. Well, wow, that's... yeah, <laughs> okay. No. Oh, this is completely crazy. I don't know where those things are. Okay, I might just have to just leave here and do this some other time, because... I'll tell you what, man. This is it. This is where they are, okay. E-R-A-U. Maybe you just have to read all three of them, or all four of them. So I didn't do that last time. Okay. Well, let's go back outside and try it again. Alright, we're almost back there. I haven't done a lot of commentary much on this. I'm, I'm kind of coming down with the flu, so, yeah. Um... The world is square. Yeah. Find the experience egg hidden in a back room in the third basement. Huh. Because I don't even know if they're talking about the third basement of here of this building or or if it's somewhere else that I suppose it won't seem as long as long as I take out the random encounters, but still, it's gonna be a long time to me. Ooh. Yeah, I've got a lot of coke, so I gotta watch the gas because I'll be burping. I'll tell ya. Okay, let us see. Well, it doesn't look like we're heading for the basement. It looks like we're heading upstairs, man. Okay, I think I just went totally the wrong way here, so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to meet you back outside. How about that? Let's look what I just found down here. Hidden room with the treasure chest and the experience egg. Which it seems like you'll be able to get that without actually doing the puzzle, but, but I actually... So there you have it. I suppose we could go ahead and equip that on somebody. Why not give it to Setzer? No particularly amazing stat, um, gains. Wait a minute, why did I just do that? Okay, I don't know why I did that. I guess when you have the Genji Glove, even if you just don't change to Genji Glove or from it, it automatically optimizes equipment. Even if you already had it. Whoa, wait a second, Osteosaur, you know what? We haven't seen one of these before. I guess we need to keep this one. Let me guess, he's weak against fire. <laughs> because aren't they all... Well, so much for that. I guess we'll never know now. That's an interesting name for a dinosaur, osteosaur. Is that like osteoporosis? 
he must have had osteoporosis considering how fast he went down. So now we've got that taken care of. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and head for Narsh. I know the game suggests we should get Gal next. Eventually we'll do that, but it doesn't really matter when you get him. Um, better to just let him stay out there and gain experience along with the rest of us. So let's see what's happened to this town. Hmm. Oh uh, no. Hey, didn't I see you in Zozo? Oh, how about that? It says we'll be here for you even if the world should crumble and well. It just did and they're still here. Red Wolf. These are the Narsh enemies you're gonna be seeing, so might as well be ready. These guys don't have a particular weakness, so you just have to go with your best physical attacks or whatever you can think of. Chocobop wouldn't be bad. That ought to do some decent damage against him. See you later. Okay. Uh-oh. What are you doing here? Doesn't matter, really. Nothing left anyway. There's only one Moogle still around, and only a treasure hunter could pick that lock. <coughs> That's right. You couldn't have possibly made it any more obvious. So apparently when the world crumbled, they locked up this town, so you can't go in any of the doors. But, with a certain character... Test Rider. Okay. These guys are actually weak against poison, so... Give it a shot, see what happens. He'll probably die. Mm-hmm. I should have placed a bet on that, because, you know, I could have made some money just now. But hey, okay. I wonder if you could still sneak in the back of Argus's... Oops. Uh, I'm not even supposed to be going that way. I to come up this way. Nasty Dawn. Nasty Dawn's weak against fire, but since we're going to be using mostly physical attacks to take care of everything else, you might as well just hit it with physical attacks, too. Oh, man, I thought I was going to get that for a second, that slot. <laughs> that would have been pretty sweet. Auto Crossbow is pretty much your best bet in this area. And Cyan's a good character to take because he's mostly physical attacking, so you can let him dish out the pain, you know, bring the pain train after all. Also, I'm pretty sure your instant death will start working again here, unlike it did in the tomb, because everything's undead out there, so it's a lucky thing we could still get in here, sneak around back here. <coughs> Sorry about that, that cough is me come through on the sound when I come back from that battle. Mm. So we're gonna try and see if we can find Mog here. He should be in this area. Red Wolf and Psychot. Or Psychote or something. Um, Psychotes are weak against ice, as they would well appear to be. But again, we're... Monsters here are fairly weak, you know, against physical stuff, so... Might as well just stick with that, the tried and true method. Cyan mastered a new technique. Uh-oh. It's, you know, it's bowling over now. Sometimes the words just don't come to you fast enough. Wizard. Wizards are weak against lightning and poison. So. But we got a little bit of a problem here. We're surrounded, so we're going to have to... I think the slot machine hits them all even when you are surrounded, but I'm not sure. We're about to find out here. Oh yes, it does. That's awesome. Well, I sure took care of those quick, didn't it? Oh, I am getting so boring on this update. Oh my god. I don't think I've been this boring yet. You know, now that I think about it, there's actually another Esper we can pick up here, but I don't know if we're ready for it yet to fight it. Because it's going to be tough. <coughs> I 
okay, that level 5 sword tech that Cyan learned actually steals a small amount of the enemy's MP and their HP, which can be pretty useful.